Good morning, T-Wolves. My name is Mason Brown, and uh, usually I would have a co-host with me. His name is Joe Boudreau. Uh, sadly, he, can, he cannot be here today, but the show must go on. And what is this show called? Well, it's called The Wolf Howl. Let's get into it. Today, there will be PSAT testing in the English wing from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. for sophomores and juniors, as well as an acting club meeting from 3.30 p.m. to 5 p.m. Tomorrow, there will be a, a financial, financial aid night and presentation from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. Expedition Amelia will take place on Sunday, October 20th from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Contact Mr. Mack for more details. And now, on to useless facts. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Useless Fact. Yes, it's our boy Sid the Sloth. Useless fact about him, all of his, little, all of his kind. They can hold their breath longer than dolphins. Yeah, so if you think about how, how long dolphins are underwater, just think of how long he can hold his breath underwater. He could be a dolphin. Anyways, that's all for me. Back to the desk, guys. Alright. Hello everyone, I'm Dan, and welcome back to Entertainment News. This is a pressing matter because things are getting really bad for Marvel, and other movies are getting awesome, and TV shows as well. Let's start off with movies. In, in the movie business, Martin Scorsese has been famously known for making gang movies and mob movies, but he has roasted Marvel saying it is not cinema, it is more along the lines of a theme park. Now. Samuel L. Jackson and a few of the other Marvel, Marvel stars of this universe have come out and said that that's like, in Samuel L. Jackson's words, that's like saying Bugs Bunny is not funny. It just, does, it just doesn't make sense to me. In my words, you can have your own opinion, but that's just, that's just kind of a bad opinion. In video game news, we have Marvel's The Avengers. It's a big game that's coming out for all Marvel fans, coming out for for PlayStation and all that stuff, and recently added is the character named Kamala Khan. If you don't know who this is, I'll just give you a brief summary. Kamala Khan is a Pakistani-American who succumbs to a strange crystal thing that creates inhumans called the Terrigen Crystals. And she gains the power to stretch and make her hands larger than life and a whole lot of weird stuff. Don't worry, she's getting her own TV show. You'll see more of her. She's getting very very famous. Now, in, in TV show news, um, well, if you guys have known of a group called The Watchmen, there was a movie um, a long time ago about it. Now they're making a TV show made by the same guys who made Game of Thrones, HBO. This series is a very different series, featuring new characters, older versions of old characters, and, Ro and Robert Redfield as the President of the United States of America. Also, there are a bunch of evil Rorschachs running around in weird ink blob masks. And just for a freebie for movies, I'd like to introduce to you to a new movie that's coming out soon, featuring everyone's favorite Canadian, Ryan Reynolds. It's called Free Guy. In this movie, you will have Ryan Reynolds, Joe Keery, Taika Waititi, and I forget the woman's name, but she's someone from Killing Eve. Um, in this show, or movie, Joe, I mean, Ryan Reynolds plays a bank teller who doesn't know that he is an NPC in a video game. This will also feature famous streamers, including Ninja and Jacksepticeye and a few others, to name, that's just to name a few. So, that's it for entertainment news today. Um, if you want more news, you can come with me. I'm still considering anime. Don't worry, I'm still thinking about it. Anyway, that's all. See you next time. Hello, T-Wolves, and, and my name is Mason Brown, and welcome to our sports report for this week. Let's get into it. There will be a boys' varsity soccer home game against Muscoma Valley High School. 
at 3.30 p.m., as well as a boys' JV soccer game, also versus Muscoma Regional, uh, and that is also at 3.30 p.m. Wish them luck, but trust me, they won't need it. Go prospect. Uh, on Friday, October 18th, the following home games will take place. Girls Varsity Soccer Game versus Inner Lakes High School at 3.30 p.m. Boys JV Soccer versus Sanborn Regional at 4 p.m. Girls JV Volleyball versus Farmington uh, High School at 3.30 p.m. Girls JV Soccer versus Inner Lakes High School at 5 p.m. As well as a Girls Varsity Volleyball Game versus Farmington High School at Farmington. Uh, this will take place at 5 p.m. And that's all I got for you today. My name is Mason Brown, and back to me at the desk. How did I get back all the way over here? I gotta ask Joe about that. Uh, sorry. All right, so that's all we have for you today. My name is Mason Brown. I'm Joe Boudreaux. Thank you. And have a good day, Prospect.